So it's a case of um, zip de doo da, zip de dee day. Wrong one. Uh, don't you be funny, game. Because this is where I am now is currently the uh, leisure district. So rule of thumb doing the game, don't build residential inside your leisure district unless it's far, far away. Let, and I'll show you one in just a second. Just so signifying that is a continuing bus lane. So you're wondering why, Palpatine, why did you build in the leisure district? Well, I'll show you why. You can in tourism, just be careful of where your transit stations are. This, your commercial zones are active 24-7. So your nightclubs are going at 4 o'clock in the morning, you're wondering why your residents are having one big massive bitchin' winch at you. So don't build your residential near it. You can with tourism, just be careful, it's mainly a case of just watch where you drop your hotels, because that usually, it's just a case of, oh, flip a duck a doodle do. It's just a simple case of, um, what your freight traffic's up to. is going to be another case of tactical urbanism 101. Uh, is that a straight through lane? Yeah, it is too. Um. That's a dash. And then we can go fillers. One, two, three, four, five. Solid gold. FM. And then one. So, hey, 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 behave game. Yeah, this is as inaccurate as Munters. That's alright. Ah, uh, not Chevys. Red. One, two, three, four, five. Solid gold. Red. Red. Done. Oh shoot, I hate when I do that. It's like, oh. Yeah, rippy doo doo doo. Cute. That's, that's that intersection done. <laughs> And that is again some very quick fire.
Okay, so that's that done. I can hopefully zoom in a little bit closer this time. No, then, uh, no. Well, no. No, they're not. Not normally. So tourism creates commercials to serve tourists by via hotel accommodation, restaurants, and other activities. Typically, all commercial zones are active 24-7 to a point. But leisure districts go one better, and they just go. Yeah, these ones are, but are the 24-7, and they create the racket. Um, yeah, so yeah, you can put residential and tourism. I've done it before without a problem. And, um, yeah, but you don't, uh, put, as soon as you put residential and leisure, you're in trouble. So, rule of thumb, just don't do it. Unless it's very far away. Okay, so now the wrong. Right, so it's. Okay, so we're just doing some more tactical urbanism. They just give a little bit of flair. So because I dropped down to first person mode, first person mode, it just gives a little bit more. Um, a little bit more flair, shall we say? Dun 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 dun. Hopefully that's the right way around. I was be going, yeah, it is. I was be going, ah, oh, crap. Okay, so that means what we need now is the... Go to decal. Oh, 
Oops. Not perfectly accurate, but close enough. Okay, so that means I just need the prop. Okay, so if we look at... Oh. Okay, hang on, one moment. <laughs> Whoops, I need to do the intersection one back. So I'll show you what it looks like from the ground level. Uh, it looks, it does look really. Really good. So if you just wait a minute, what I'll do is I'll drop the ground level and I'll show you what it looks like. Oh, that should already be there. Let's drop another one. Okay. So this is what it looks like when you drop to the ground. So you got the one way. Bus lane that comes around. Yeah, oh, KFC. Bit of tactical urbanism right there. Turn back around. 25 advisory sign. The compulsory left turn. Thank you, game. Again, the tactical urbanism right there. The wrong way. And then you come round, again the one way, and if you're going straight through, away you go. So that is another one done.